Vin Chateau here, physical therapist with the Physical Therapy Advisor. Today we're going to talk about a taping technique I use for posterior tibialis tendon dysfunction, also known as PTTD. It happens a lot to runners, those that are often on their feet a lot. And the pain is usually on the inside of the leg and down towards the arch of the leg. I know it's a little hard to see in this video, but I want you to see the technique. I'm going to use a kinesio, uh, kinesio tape style um, of tape. I often use, well, use rock tape, KT tape, uh, mummy tape. There's all sorts of different brands. They all work pretty well. Um, sometimes though, if I need a little bit more rigidity in the tape, I'll use a Luco tape. Uh, it's very sticky. It doesn't, you can't keep it on the skin for very long. Uh, you can also use an athletic tape. Again, that's for a short duration use. And if you need something a little more rigidity, Otherwise, you can use the kinesio tape style tape, and this can stay on for many days, which is why I like this um, as a, as a um, tape for this particular issue. So the first thing we do is we'll break the tape, and we want to apply the tape, and I've already pre-cut for her leg. Uh, apply that first inch of the tape with one inch, no stretch. So she's gonna hold her foot up for me and bring the toes towards you. And right here on the ankle bone is where we're gonna start that tape. We'll start it right there, just a little bit in front of the bone. And you might even have to hold it at first to make sure it adheres. And then you'll peel most of the tape for the, until that last inch or so. And then you're gonna do between a 50 and a 75% stretch. The tape's gonna wrap around the back of the heel Try not to get too many wrinkles, and it'll come right behind the bone where the posterior tibialis uh, tendon goes. And then we're gonna end up on the bottom of the foot. And this is where it really is helpful because it helps lock in that arch. Now this tape actually got a little bit long for her, and that's okay, because if it wraps up over to the side, it'll just adhere that much better. So now you can see the tape's pulling this direction, it wraps around the back of the heel and then anchors it towards the bottom, which is gonna give a little bit more support for the arch um, and the navicular bone where the posterior tibialis tendon um, originates from. So now as I turn her around, you can see here the bottom of the foot has that support and as it comes back around this direction is where you get that extra support. And if you need more support, oftentimes uh, if it's a bigger leg, perhaps, I'll use two strips of tape and do it the exact same way. It'll just end a little bit different. Or like I said, if you need a little bit more rigidity, then you can use a Luco tape or an athletic training style tape. Uh, just remember that tape can't stay on very long. Or this tape, she might keep on three to five days. So if you want uh, more information, please visit my website at thephysicaltherapyadvisor.com. Also check out my Facebook page and my YouTube channel. Thank you.